right? Are we rolling? We're rolling. So uh, we're going to talk about deconstruction and reconstruction today, right? Because here we have this big old oak desk, which is a fantastic item, right? It's antique, it's a desk. The problem is, a lot of times in these days, uh, we don't have a use for a big desk. So what can we do here? Because we don't want to throw the desk out. We couldn't even give this away last week. But wait. So what did, what did Rob do this afternoon? He deconstructed this. We take the top off like this. Hold on. <laughs> it's a little bit of a challenge. It's really a two-person job, and he's holding the camera. So we take the top off. Then we have a top, which can be used for something else. We have the drawer in the middle, which we can use for something else, maybe displaying some small items in our hardware department. We throw that over here. What are we left with? These two maybe end table type things. But look, they don't have complete tops. There's just this, this is the slide it used to come out of the, right? So what do we do? We take some antique lumber that we salvaged from a barn and put a nice finish on it. Obviously, we would make it a different size. These are just samples, in case you were wondering. And we could make a top like this and make this fantastic table that's a reasonable size that has storage in it. Or you could maybe argue that, you know, you could make it a little bigger and you can make a small desk out of it. Maybe. But um, the idea is we take something that really doesn't have a good use, not too much utility, take it apart, add some salvaged lumber that we got from a barn and voila we have useful furniture our phone's ringing say about that no but our phone's ringing phone's ringing